Hello and welcome to K-Man Gaming. I am K-Man and this is Factorio. Well, last episode we got our first small solar array up and running and we actually whizzed through a little bit of research. Let's continue with the research today. Uh, and we will start working our way towards our purple science or our production science pack so let's get that up and running let's just finish off a few of these little um, quick 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 so let's go down um, I've just had a quick look at the product production science pack and what we actually need to get everything up and running and it looks like it's rail, um, electric furnish, furnace, and production um, modules. So it's not going to be too difficult. It's nothing that we haven't actually already got set up. Um, we've got the, the individual components created in our base. We just have to actually stick them all together to create these new um, elements. So it's not going to be too difficult to put these all up. Let's bring our solar into our power array here so we can start benefiting from the from the power it's giving us. I don't know how much it's added there. I have absolutely no idea how much it's added. Production science pack almost here. It's almost on its way. We will need to recreate the the rails um, print there so let's actually we've built it once there's no point in us building it again let's take it down south with us and we'll put it onto our production side of our bus ready to bring it all over into the science side of our bus the science creation side of the bus I completely forgot to get squeak through completely forgot to get squeak through between episodes but no worries, we will get that all created soon. Let's have a look. Um, paste. What was it we needed here? It was iron. First on the belt, we'll bring this down. Ah, we need to get some more iron on the belt. That's absolutely something that we need to do. Let's just copy and paste that bit for now probably made a bit more work for us actually than would have been just doing it manually but there we go so we've got iron coming onto here and then we had stone and steel have we even got stone coming down I don't even know that we've got stone coming down there we go Let's get that there. and then we'll just have to jump this What's going there? There we go. Let's bring that all down. And we'll do the north and south where we can. Let's try and stick stick to what we should be doing. And I'm gonna bring it in so that we've got the, the four jump, the four jump, four jump two, four jump two. all the way down I just want to take a quick moment guys to absolutely thank you for all of the comments that you have been commenting on on this channel actually this is the one of the main reasons that I created a, a YouTube channel um, was to hear all of your your guys ideas as we're, as we're playing this game um, to hear the input that you guys have got and the things that you do differently um, and the ways that I can play the game better myself so if any of you have got any ideas or if you've spotted any mistakes that I've done and you're silently shouting out on your screen no you shouldn't be doing that please do let me know um, and I will get it um, I will get it sorted next time it will have to wait till next time I do the um, the recording because I sometimes I record these in a few episodes at a time 
um, but I will absolutely get it rectified as soon as possible. Let's bring this down. So we've got one, two, three, four. The aim, the idea of this channel eventually will be um, when I've got enough uh, followers and when we've got enough um, time for, when we've got enough people um, inputting, then ideally what I want to do is um, play. Oh dear, that wasn't right. There we go. I, I'll start this one again. As you can see, multitasking is still, still not a strong point for me. Um, the idea of this channel is eventually to have some followers so that when we're playing games, we can actually make decisions on the games together. So maybe you tell me what you would like me to build next, or maybe if we're playing a different game, you tell me what you would like to attack next, or we discuss strategy together. Um, and we'll actually go and do it on the channel and we can see the outcomes together as a team. So that's the idea of, of having this YouTube channel. That's really where I want to get to um, with everything. We're a little way off yet. We are a little way off yet. Um, but that is the plan. Oops, we do need to get some electric power poles. And I do recognize actually that's something that the solar array is missing out on. What I'll do is I'll just add to the solar array um, off camera, probably. As you've seen, once you've seen the solar array been built once, you've, you've seen it there. It's not going to change. It's not going to become different each time. We have got the let's just build this out so that we can get it um, balanced on the belt I think this was actually um, a balancer that I saw Nilaus create so thank you very much Nilaus for for that wizardry um, let's just smash through all of these quickly just while we're we're talking and getting on with what I'm doing you have to excuse a bum bum bums um, there we are We've got our rails. What else do we need for the purple science pack? We need our electric furnaces. Now we will go and add an electric furnace to the make everything, but for now we also want to still play advanced circuits and stone bricks. Stone bricks not something we're creating currently. Oh goodness, and we need some electric furnaces to be able to create the stone bricks. So let's do a little bit of a hack first. Let's just create five of these and we can get these creating our first stone bricks so that whoops too far too many I pressed the wrong button we can get these creating our first stone bricks so that we can cr manually create some electronic furnaces and then we can just use the electronic furnaces in our build so that's creating us our stone bricks now we'll leave that for a second and we'll be able to create these to have in our build. Stone bricks will come along in a moment and then that leads into advanced circuits and steel plates. Now I haven't actually reminded myself of how many we need so let's look into a new sub factory. Let's go into our purple science. Let's go into our factory planner. That's what I was trying to say. Let's go into our factory planner. Let's go into purple science and let's add the Yep, and then we want 100 purple science minute. Where are we going? There we are. 100 purple science minutes, 100 purple science minute. And then we need, so that's 16 of there. We need a thousand of these being produced a minute. So we need six of these. So our array that we've actually created here. What am I doing where? We don't need that. That was entirely wrong. that no z that can we do that yep that should work so we actually don't need to worry about jiggling this there we have we do need to change this now though let's actually copy and paste it there 
There we go. And let's oh, let's see. We've done that correct. Did it do all of our stone? I think it oh it's already done all of our stone. There we go, let's just remove it. Boom boom boom. Let's remove these. Now we want to copy and paste, so we actually want another so we want five more. One, oops. One, two, three, four, five. That should be all of the all of the rails that we need for now. Um, and I've run out of little assembly machines. We might have to now start upgrading actually to red belts. I don't know how many, if we're going to be able to carry all of these rails on as we need with the with the belts that we've got. So we've got our six there. So that's six for the all of the rails. We need that minute. Electric furnaces, we need 33 electronic furnaces. So this is built into four machines. That means we need 333, so we need 18 of these. Let's change that, actually. We need nine, and we've just got enough. We've just got enough to start producing electronic furnaces. So that was the, the little boost that we needed, really, to start creating the electronic furnaces. We'll get that added onto our make everything as well um, in a moment. So we're going to... We're going to do our nine of these. Oh, three. Let's copy. Oh no, we're going to need electricity, of course, for these ones now. Six, eight, and then nine, and then, oh goodness me, I didn't even add what we need to add to them. And these will all get through our, whoops, these will all get through our stone. So let's bring that back as well. All the way back. And we will change. We will put those, let's jump them, jump them, jump them, so we can continue our One, two, three, four. Is that where we need to jump? So there, normally. One. Oh, well, of course, we can't jump that. Can't jump that one either, but we'll leave it. We'll leave it. Lest I confuse myself any more than I already have. And then these are all coming out. These are all going to be used by science. We need to bring it this way because it will be going over. Oh, it will be going over to our purple science to feed our hundred purple science a minute. That will also come back here. For and let's just get ourselves even more quick. We're not producing any military science next yet. Um, electric engine. Let's just add all of those on for now. Um, just to give ourselves something to, to we'll just give ourselves something to research. Now, do we need to put in a recipe for this? No, we just need to connect it up to the electricity. There we are. So one, two, three, four, five. And let's one, and we'll have that on that side. So now we've got a full belt coming out, and productivity modules we need productivity modules as well is it best to make productivity modules at the top and then bring everything down let's just bring everything down here let's just do a little bit of of housekeeping whilst we're here let's bring the bus all the way down otherwise what's the point in having the bus eh We've only got it on half our factory. Let's bring it all the way down. Let's bring all of our lovely, lovely resources that we've taken the time to gather so that they're all accessible to us. And let's jump that. Jump. Jump. 
jump, 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 jump. And then we'll also jump this one as well. Is this copper? I think, I feel like that was copper that we've left ages ago. I feel like we left copper miles away. There we go. We're going to need one red for that. Just to keep it all going nicely. And there we go. So that's those coming down. Let's just do this as well. Our pipes. And then, have we got anything coming up there? So we've got... That's our petroleum as well. Is that going to cause us difficulties? I shouldn't think so. What are these batteries? Do we need them yet? Are we going to need them at all? I just don't know. I just don't know. Sulfur. Maybe, let's put, how many do we need? How many of those do we need? We need 10. 10. Well, el sorry, where did I even get 10 from? 12, because we need to round up. Maybe we just have them produced here and go back onto, go back onto that line. nothing else being built here is there it's just quick and dirty it's just the starter base let's have a look at how we do that okay hmm okay I know how we're gonna do this our typical two two machine build two smalls two large and we want them producing Productions. How many of these produce a second? 15 seconds. Okay, plenty of time. And then we'll bring them out. That's right. One, two. Okay, so 12 of these we need. We do one, six, and then this is the one that we will. One, two, three. Oops. Paste it again some more. One, two, three. So there we've got our 12. So this is all of the production modules that we need. Okay. Do I want to give them their own belt? I think I do. I want to give them their own belt because later on when we get down if we need anything else that has production modules and honestly i can't remember if we do but it saves me having to split the red circuits out later on so let's just carry this on up like this whoops oh we've run out of the blue run out of the blue as well there we go now we've got everything there all the way along need to connect it up to the power there we go now they're all going and hopefully they will all bring us some lovely lovely production modules let's bring that up there down oh nice and fast zoomies ah oh, we've done the wrong one <laughs> there we go Let's bring this, this out. Oh, I'm destroying everything. There we go. Let's bring that all out there. And we'll do that again. Zoomies. One. All the way down. All the way down. Nice and fast. Ooh. There we go. So, just need one more jump. 
and this should be our purple science very nearly ready for let's create this is going to have to be the next bus and we will how are we going to do this let's bring that onto there like that let's bring that that way and then do we is that going to work because this takes half a second it's going to have to be a red belt I think Let's let's change this to red belt. Oh, we're gonna also going everything's gonna need to be red now, isn't it? We'll probably start migrating to red belts entirely. We've got it now. We'll use up what we've got there, and then we will migrate. So let's just put these quick and dirty on there until we can change them all. Let's put that on there. Is this going to help us? Is this going to... When it's all going... Does it need to be a double line? No, surely not. Surely not. Look, there we go. Okay, so we've just got our first... There we go. That is our first um, belt. And I've brought it down here because that's just already a little bit polluted there we've got our production we've got our <laughs> oh, I was silly to think it would be this easy completely forgot to do um, the, the stone bricks there so stone bricks steel plates and advanced circuits how many do we need creating them four okay so we've got our one two three four and these will go well these will take one two and then they will take those going in let's cut them put it there that's as far out as that needs to come these will come in and then they will put them off this way how long does it take them to create five seconds five seconds crafting time and it only needs is that right is that right it only needs four it must be it's better it's better than maths than I am so I will trust the factorio planner in its almighty wisdom and trust that it knows better than I what's going on let's just move these back just a moment now Oh, let's get rid of the yellows first so we will need it up here have I just put that on the wrong one nope that's right and then steel where's steel do we want steel coming just across there Maybe we do. We could just do it like that, couldn't we? And then we'll just have it all the way along. That's not going to change anything. Underground. Over. and I think that is okay for that one we'll need to bring these across so it now needs to it's going to create one two three four five six seven eight 
three, four. Is that going to create it fast enough? It must. It must. Let's bring these directly back across this way. One, two. There we go. That's the uh, the last of the yellow undergrounders. What's going on there? No, that was right. Slowly moving our way to a red circuit space. This has got to be red. So let's start. I'm probably not going to bring that down very far. Just for now, because I don't know what else is needed. I don't know what else it might need it for. Tum. Oh, what have I done here? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Maybe I didn't pull. Of course, because it goes down there. There we are. Um, that's that. And then we also now need to split this we'll split across and then down under down under down under let's change that for now down under let's continue in that along let's bring these under to where they Oh, well, now I've made a mistake. Hmm, 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 hmm. Let's bring it down one. I am probably just getting, just deleting a whole load of resources there without thinking. If I bring that one down, that's not going to help me, is it? I am going back. I'm going back to what the original plan was, and we'll trust that we might not need sulfur for a while. We'll hope that we might not <laughs> need sulfur for a while. I can't remember if we have even do need anything else for sulfur. To be honest, we might not actually need it anymore, so it might be just a waste of time having it on the belt anyway. Um, if anyone does know, please do let me know, um, and I'll get rid of it if it if it can be got rid of. Um, so we can delete those down because we don't want those anymore. Um, let's replace that back again there. Let's get rid of this steel so that everything can be building appropriately. Um, that's all going well and now we can come up to let's just get on with some more research green 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 fine 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 and then we need 16 of these so we'll do one two one two we've got three rows and I what does a purple need purple needs 30 rails one electric furnace one productivity module so our first our closest will be our rails and that will have its own its own row and then these will be our secondaries. Long-handed inserters. So let's just hook those up now. We want productivity modules going into one of them. Let's 
let's just have this come down round. Oops. It needs to come down one more. There we go. Oh, there's loads of furnaces. Maybe I shouldn't have worried. And then they're coming out on either side. Great. We've got our rails coming up that way and then we can pull out our purple signs there. How many of we, them do we need? 16. So 8 of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, Oh. Oh. Now it's ugly. Seven, eight. Oh, I so like straight lines. We'll deal with it. We will deal with it and we will move on. Let's add these on to our science build. And there we go. There we have it. Let's just connect this up here, quick and dirty. That, with a bit of luck, maybe should be making us all of the pub science that we need. This can do three in 21 seconds. So. Hopefully everything else is going to be coming along and everything will get what it needs and nothing's going to be starved. Oh goodness me, look. We absolutely need some more stone though, don't we? Too much stone, or not enough stone coming through. Where's the stone coming from? Where is our stone coming from? There. We absolutely need to up stone production. Let's, whilst we're coming, whilst we're going this way, let's just upgrade everything to a red belt probably use upgrade planner for it let's just do it here we go so nanobot range is getting bigger it's all being um, upgraded oh well it's all got reds there so I'll have to look at how to change that so we, those are fine these are fine we can upgrade them these two bits that bit there that bit across there let's bring all of this is to red now as well we're moving our way I suppose this is no longer becoming a starter base really is it we're, we're being forced to move through to a mid base but let's go and add those stones on and then I think that will be a nice place to stop the episode. Um, if you've enjoyed watching it, please do um, like and leave a comment. Um, if you've got any suggestions or anything like that, I'm more than happy to, to listen to them. And if it's practical, I'll implement them on the next recording session. Um, so yeah, just, just let me know. And I look forward to hearing from you. Um, thank you very much and have a great day.